Welcome back to the KOAM News at Noon. We are live at Our Best Bank in 2023 East 32nd Street uh, for our Great American Flag Swap. I'm going to tell you right now, we are down already to the last few. We had 100. I saw we even had a little more than that. And this line filled up so fast that we are running out quickly. I'm joined now, though, by Rebecca Dunham with Arvest Bank. And so, of course, they're one of our sponsors here for the Great American Flag Swap. Tell me a little bit about this. What... What got Arvest involved? What made this something appealing? Well, we know in this area of the country in particular, flying the American flag and being proud and showing your patriotism is very popular. And we thought, what better way to help out people in the community by helping them swap out, get a fresh new flag for the summer season. And of course, just in time for the 4th of July with this flag swap, but this of course isn't the last one either. Still got some coming up, so if folks are still interested, what are some other dates they have, or do you have those dates? I don't have those dates, but I'm sure they will be announced as soon as they're up and running. Uh, and we'll have all those spots running. So in terms of the turnout, how's it been so far? It's been significant. Uh, we started at noon today, but we had folks that were showing up around 1015 ready and eager to swap out their flags. So a lot of enthusiasm. And I've gotten to meet so many great people today. It's just been great to be out with the people in the community. And what's it like to see that enthusiasm for people wanting to do the right thing with their American flags? You know, that's a great point because despite Disposing of the flag properly is an important part, and it's just heartwarming for me to see so much care and support again of our American flag and people that want to do this correctly. It's great to see. All right, Rebecca, thank you so much for joining us on this extremely hot day here in the four states. And as mentioned, we've got that alert day for the heat. We're going to talk about that here in just a moment. But first, Mr. Food.